Hi, I'm Michael Oliver, owner of Oliver Realty in Tucson, Arizona. Today I'm going to help you with negotiating on a home purchase. When you're negotiating to buy a home, the idea is obviously to get the best price possible. And how to do that is essentially you need to start towards the bottom of what a realistic offer is. There's a rule of thumb that we generally use, which is 10% less than the asking price that the seller has the house listed for. The 10% less than the asking price is just a rule of thumb. If the market's really hot, you may need to come in 5% less than asking price, or you may need to just pay full price and feel good about getting the house at all. The real estate broker that you work with will help you with understanding what the dynamics of the market are and where to start your negotiation at. So once you bring in your first initial offer, what you need to have happen is the seller to counter your offer. The seller should always counter. If the seller accepts your initial offer, you simply start it too high. Once the seller counters your offer, you simply want to inch up on the pricing. You don't want to meet in the middle. You don't want to just take their price unless it's a really good deal. You just want to simply go up a little bit at a time. Two, three thousand dollar increments are perfectly fine. So once the seller is coming down on price, eventually they will get to a point where they will not count you anymore. When that happens, you get to decide whether or not you want to take that price or if you want to undercut it just a little bit and see if you can get the seller to go along with it. That ensures you got the best pricing possible on that specific home. So again, I'm Michael Oliver with Oliver Realty. Hopefully this video helped you understand the dynamics of negotiating when you're buying a home. If there's anything else we can do for you, just let us know. We'll be happy to help. Thank you for watching and subscribe if you like this.